Um, I want to talk with you about protein and where do I get protein in my plant-based diet which is all fresh living plant foods. Well I first of all love sprouts. Sprouts are the top form of protein, plant protein on this planet. So it's very easy to sprout right in your own kitchen. So I love sprouting sunflower greens, broccoli sprouts, clover sprouts. Those are excellent forms of protein and I put them every day into my salad. A lot of different sprouts. I also get protein from leafy green vegetables. Many people are surprised when they hear that we can get sufficient protein from leafy greens, but we get a lot of protein from them. Spinach by calorie has 49% protein, kale about 45% protein, and dark green lettuces like romaine about 34% protein. And we also don't need to worry about protein. You never hear of anybody dying of a protein deficiency. There is protein in all plant foods. Even a, one banana has about 5% complete protein. Mango has all eight essential amino acids. So we're certainly getting the protein by eating a variety of plant foods. And I always suggest looking for the rainbow. I used to tell my kids when, we were, when they were young and we would go to the store, I asked them to pick a fruit and a vegetable for every color of the rainbow. And that way they would be getting all the various nutrients that we need. And each one of those plants has a different percentage of protein. So you see we get protein from all the plants that grow. And we don't need to get our protein from animal food because animal food put stress on the liver and the kidneys and builds up an acid in the liver called arachidonic acid. And that liver, when it builds up to a point of, you know, where you can't tolerate it anymore, that's when we start seeing autoimmune conditions and we start seeing the diseases of today. So we don't need to have animal protein. We can get it from plants and plants are much more easily digested and they don't have cholesterol, they don't have all that saturated fat and so we want to get our protein from these sources that are loaded with nutrients and loaded with the water content that we need to live full healthy lives and so those nutrients I believe are what are giving me the energy as I'm getting older. When you have the energy and you're getting the calories you need, you don't need to worry about the protein. 